Well, hello everyone. Well, the last time we were together, David had a little bit of a crash wearing those uh, bat wings that the vampire family were kind enough to give to him. But you'll be pleased to know that I did take him to Helen DeVos Children's Hospital to get him checked out. And he just has a few bumps and bruises. He's totally fine. But David wanted to wear his um, medical costume just as a thank you to all the wonderful doctors and nurses and the rocking awesome awesome child life specialists that really helped David um, when he was feeling a little nervous about going in for his x-rays and everything they explained what was to happen and he loved the play-doh they brought him and all of that so David loves wearing costumes and he thought well this might be nice to uh, honor the nice doctors and nurses and staff and everyone that helped him at Helen DeVos Children's Hospital. So thank you for that, you guys. So anyway, um, David is going to uh, show me the way to the dungeon right now so we can go and open up the next day's activities or crafts or games. I don't know what's in there, but let's go find out. Let's go down to the dungeon and see. Thanks. All right, so here we go. Nope, for day three. That looks interesting. Get some glitter glue, some scissors. Looks like a paper with a wand to do. Alright. Contents. And what we're going to be making is jiggly bog slime. So the first thing we have to do is to fill the container here up with two cups of boiling water. So let's do that first. Definitely use a grown up to help you with this, but I'm going to use my magic. So here we have the water, super hot here, and it's definitely been brought to a boil. It also might be something to, for sure, ask an adult to do to help you with that. I used my magic, but an adult can just put that right in the microwave and get that to happen for you. So next we pour in... Ooh, isn't that a beautiful color? That is our soon-to-be green slime, our bog slime. And we're gonna, oh, that smells amazing too. Very lemony, I mean, very limey. And then we're supposed to um, stir this for two minutes. We're going to fill it up with, up to the water line with cold water. Okay, so now we have this. So now it's time to add our creepy things to go into our bog slime. Oh yeah, these amazing gummy snakes. Why did I have to pick this one? <laughs> it's so awesome. In they go. Ooh, these are all very fun. Why do I have to keep picking these ones? And we also have these. Little, little bugs and butterflies, which are so good. I'm gonna pop those in there too and really make our bog, bog slime extra creepy. And grab some more snakes. In we go. Oh yeah. So now, Cover this up, and for you guys, you put it in the refrigerator for four hours, but I'm going to use my magic and have it ready. It looks tasty to me. So here we have our activity our worksheet for day three and it says here for us to make a wand 
and we might need a grown-up's help to cut out the wand and then we get to decorate it. And I'm going to use my glitter glue and I'm also going to use my colored pencils as well. So first I'm going to cut it out, but I'm going to use my super speed. Hi again. Oh my gosh, that was so fun, you guys. Who knew that bog slime could be so tasty? And guess what? Tomorrow is our very last day. So I cannot wait to see what the grand finale is that David has planned for us. But I thought it might be fun if we all dressed up in our costumes. So please go ahead and do that. And David said, hey, if you don't have a costume, don't worry about it. He's got something planned in the box for tomorrow too. So, um, so no stress. If you've got a costume, wear it. If not, he's got something in mind. So anyway, um, I think probably my favorite thing from today, aside from eating the delicious bog slime, was making the wands because this is so, so different for me as a as a witch because I kind of do my spells in a snap, you know, if you haven't noticed. I've never really done a wand before. I don't even know if this thing works. Yeah, well, I guess this thing doesn't work. David? Oh no, David! <gasps> I turned David into a frog. Oh, wow. Well, okay, I'm gonna have to figure this one out. I, I hope that your wand only works with your imagination and not actual magic. Um, I'm gonna work on this and I I'll see you guys, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks.